How's it going guys? In this video, I will be teaching you how you can create a Pin and Trust Ads account. So in order to create a Pin and Trust Ads account, what you need to do is basically go to ads.pinandtrust.com. And once you are at this website, you will come across a page like this. Require a Pin and Trust account in order to access the main dashboard and you can register for a Pin and Trust account by simply clicking on the sign up button present on top over here. And once you have signed in, you will be able to access your ads dashboard. Now, promoting on Pin and Trust is very, very simple. As you can see, Pin and Trust provides four simple steps right in front of us. Let's just go through each one of them quickly. So the first one is pick a pin. So over here, you need to pick a particular pin that you want to promote. You want to get across your target audience. And uh, basically, it's a very simple process. All you need to do is just select from the huge database that you have on your Pin and Trust account. And even if you don't have a huge uh, you know, database of pins, what you can do is just simply create a new one and uh, basically select that in order to promote. The second step is decide who sees it. Now this is a very very essential part and uh, over here you need to target who you want your pin to show to. So this is a really essential part and uh, we will be talking about this part later in this course. Now the third step is basically paying for the results. Now obviously Pin and Trust takes some money uh, in order to promote and show these ads to their huge uh, audience database and basically you can select a payment method over here and uh, see how much you want to pay. Now the last and this is not the least keep in mind fourth step is tracking what's working and what's not working. Now I will be talking about A to B testing and why it is really important when you're creating ads on Pin and Trust. So basically you need to track all your ads and see which campaign is performing the best and whichever does you need to just basically scale it up to get more sales or whatever goal you're trying to achieve. So tracking is really essential. So these are the four steps and I hope you are now logged into your Pin and Trust dashboard. Uh, the ads dashboard will look something like this and as you can see it's really really neat and decent and uh, all right so i will be going through the pin and trust ads dashboard in much more detail later in this course thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next lecture